Hello, my name is Gabriel from Gavak Business. So if you have the problem that you have to get your brand known, here I'm going to teach you a few things that it will help you in order to improve your business. So if you know, like Amazon or maybe Zappos here, they send you the box. Uh, they don't send you just the box. They send you the box with their brand. Uh, with their website. Sometimes they do that, and others they don't. Here I have a few examples here. I have a black box, I mean black bag, and people send these kind of things. I mean, I buy many things, so most of my things are online, and they send it like, like that. So if you don't want to lose business, this is one way so you can improve it. So if you send something like that, People will not know what is this uh, envelope about, so you will have some disadvantages. So here I'm going to teach you a few things. Here, get your brand known. So the first thing that you should do is put the brand on the box. The second one will be like a very short description, and the third one will be the website. So that is what I recommend. And the benefits, it will be this. this. One, the postman or the people that work in the post office, they will see your brand. That is good. So there are many thousands and thousands of people working in the post office all over the world, depending on where you send the, the packages and everything. Second one, the second benefit, it will be the neighbors, because you, when you send something, like a big box, like I just showed you, maybe the box will be sitting on the floor, or in the, I mean, next to the door where it has to be delivered and the neighbor will see it. So that is a good thing. They will see your brand. And the third, it will be your friends and your families and of course you, I mean, the other person who was going to get the, the box. So when friends are going to go to their home, I mean, to their customer's home, and their, the family, they will see the, the box and they may ask, oh, okay, what is this about? Or they will see it if they did the proper marketing action. So in this case, if you put your brand description, a website, that would be great. So I'm going to teach you, like in this case, we have Dishiki, these people, they put the, the brand, they put this electronics, and in this case, in this side, they didn't put the website. So what I would do, if they, if they, if they want to improve their market, marketing strategy, they should put their website here. But they have it here, at least in one side of the box. That is a, a good thing. The worst is nothing. And I have another box from them. So here we, you will see it says Dishiki Electronics, and it, it says the the website. So that is wonderful. So uh, we can see in the other side is, is like that. Here we have just maybe the wrapping tape. Uh, it doesn't say much in the wrapping tape, but if you use wrapping tape, try to do the, the same thing. So it says electronics and at least in the type, uh, wrapping tape, I don't see the website, but that is something to improve. And if we see here, Amazon, Amazon, well, they is very well known, but if someone sees for, first, for the first time, they will not know what is it about. So it would be good if they can put some a little description, the website, because, you know, if something, someone is new, they will not know it. In the wrapping tape, they, they have, they say Amazon Prime, and they say read Kindles, books for free, and something like that. So here in the wrapping tape, maybe it's a little bit better. Like I have here, like I showed you before, I have another envelopes that is, I mean, it's just the label. Uh, so it can reach its place and that's it. Here I have a empty, okay, an empty envelope, but it doesn't say anything. So if, if you want to start from something very simple, maybe you can print this or you can send them to have them made the way you, you wanted. The, the bag, the black bag, that doesn't say anything. And we have, we have here sapos.com. Uh, uh, so in the same name, they add the .com. So at least you know the website. You may know what it is about because the logo is, is like a shoe. But um, other than that, um, they sell clothing and, and, other th and tennis shoes and other, other things like that. So uh, what I, I would recommend is to add, like I said, 
description a website, a list, a list description. Uh, if you are not very tech savvy, you may not know what is .com, but I don't know. Uh, and the wrapping tape, as you can see, is all white. It doesn't say anything. So what I would recommend them is to add uh, those kind of things. Because, like I said before, you have many uh, people watching the boxes everywhere. So if every, every time you have to send something, you can do something like that, that would be awesome. Another thing that it will be like a bonus that I'm going to tell you here is maybe what you can do is add a little advertisement. I would recommend like a small magnet saying the same thing, brand, description, website, and maybe if you want some, co I mean, some code, so they might have some discount if you like that uh, technique, or you can tell them, okay, you will have this benefit uh, if you if you share it with your friend, or maybe if you register your device or whatever you bought, yeah, next time you may get um, some freebie, it's a thing that you can, man, you can deliver to the customer. So that, that would be my approach. When you're sending the box, don't send just the box or the envelope uh, with nothing. So remember, you're losing business uh, that way. So if you can do that, that would be great. If you like this idea, leave me a, a comment in the section below. Remember to like this video if you like it. If you dislike it, click on dislike. Subscribe to my channel to see more tips about business and everything related and see you next time.